Hey, hello there, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Go by One Chief Compadre, and you're watching Chief Stocks TV. Where I'm on my channel, we're talking about savings, investing, even politics. So, I'm just uh, reading over this article here. It's called The Insider, and it's talking about Walmart and how they're uh, pretty much uh, going away from railway to using a new company. To allow for people to buy now and pay later but the catch is this time they're gonna charge you interest so pretty much little way and it's buy now pay later are the same thing with a different name but now they're gonna make sure that they make some money off of you in the process so uh, Walmart does away with little way which didn't carry any fees and announced new buy now pay later programs that will charge customers interest walmart decided to get rid of Lailway before the 2021 holiday season so they're really trying to catch catch up with that money they lost they're really trying to get that money back uh the company announced it's using a firm and i had a video about a firm that was explaining that you definitely do not want to um use this uh platform because it's pretty much um uh, basically going to put you in uh debt where you probably can't get out of so a buy now pay later service the retailer partner with in 2019 so basically i'll put that uh link down below in my uh comment section so you can uh review that video uh, Walmart uh, started to phase its railway out last year, only allowing it to select jewelry purchases. So Walmart has decided to scrap its railway program completely before the 2021 holiday season, replacing it with a buy now, pay later financing option. This is going to get real ugly. This is not good, people. Do not, do not, do not, do not borrow this uh do not get involved with this uh new platform i'm telling you it's going to lead to a lot of people being in debt and basically you guys if you don't have enough money to uh pay for a lot of gifts for your children during the holiday season it's okay to give one gift like i said it's okay to give one gift if you can Buy a gift and pay it off outright. I'd rather you do that than buy 10 to 20 gifts and you have to pay back in installments along with interest. And at the end of the day, you're in debt. I'd rather you be out of debt and, you know, you, pretty much you are also teaching your children about not being wasteful, not being greedy and appreciate the simple things. The most important thing is being with your family, people, not so much all these gifts. So don't get caught up in the hype and don't get uh, sucked into these uh, companies trying to get you to buy things on installments so they can charge you all this interest and keep you in debt. But let me let me continue. Uh, the retailer is now using the company of firm, which partnered with Walmart in 2019. To replace Lilway instead of having stores hold items from late August through mid December, 